What's up, YouTube? This your girl, Mona Roy, and I'm back with another video. Today, we're going to be having girls talk. I want you to link in the bio. I want you to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you can, if you like watching. And let's get into the video. First question is, why do females pick penis over priorities? I think females pick penis over priorities because all they care about is sucking and having sex with the next female man. Like, who does that? <laughs> this generation. Number two question is, why do why do males be scared to go to the doctors? <laughs> Personally, I think males scared to go to the doctors because they already know they burn. For real, for real. And they scared to get the answers they already know. Like, who don't go to the doctors to get checked out? <laughs> That's crazy. Number three, do you associate with females that don't clean their vagina? They, to the person that sent this question on do I associate with females that don't clean their vagina? Hell no. I don't get down like that at all. All the females that I hang around is intact, ensure that their hygiene is clean. They take good care of their hygiene. Their vagina is always clean. Per, per. Number four, what motivates you? My kids motivates me all day, every day. To the fillets, without them, this wouldn't be possible. Number five, do you have a plan on or doing a collab with anyone? If so, who? I would love to do a collab with Dorsey and Nisha and more. It's a lot I would love to do collabs with. Um, you know, small YouTubers, big YouTubers, they don't matter. Number six, how old are you? <laughs> you will find that on the next video. <laughs> Number seven. Number seven is, what made you start a YouTube channel? What made me start a YouTube channel is watching other YouTubers like Jazz and Tay, Fila, Sifu, Dose, Nisha, Funny, Mai, etc. And many more. I just love recording, so why not put it to use? Number eight. After 10 years of marriage, your husband is still a ninja with his phone. What do you do? Now, this question was really tricky. I had to really think about it. What would I do? I would have a one-on-one -on -one talk with him and put strict guidelines on things, on the situation and everything. I would throw that whole phone away. Like, after 10 years, no, that's a no-no. No, dead. That's dead. Number 10, did you ever deal with a girl? Huh, I think that's number nine. Number nine, I'm sorry, y'all. Number nine, yes, I have dealt with a girl before a minute ago. Number 10, if you could change one thing in your life, what would it be? I would change dealing with certain males I have dealt with. Why? Because I felt like my time was used. I waste my time and money and shit. I thought it was But it made me a better person. It made me stronger. I'm still surviving. I'm, you know, I'm still going to do things. But I'm making the best that I can. Period. Number 11. When do you know to cut a, a male off? Baby girl. Baby girl. You should cut any male off. If that man not treating you right. Showing you no attention, not not giving you enough attention when you want it, not showing you that you matter, huh? When he's talking to other females, having sex with other females, all that. No, it's time to cut him off immediately. Period. You deserve better. Goes for all the females out here. We deserve better. Cut that feet, cut that male off. If he's not treating you right, you deserve way more. 
what that male don't do, the next one will. Trust me, he will. Goes for females too. What you're not doing, <laughs> the next female won't do. Period. Like, I really like this girl's talk, but I want y'all to like, comment, subscribe to my channel. If y'all like what y'all see, comment in the <laughs> down below and tell me what more do you want me to talk about. And I'm out.